This is Stephen Whitesides with Greenbrier Percussion playing on a Mapex Saturn series drum set. <coughs> the green sparkle lacquer finish on it is amazing looking, all hand done. The shells are paper thin. There are six ply on the toms and eight ply on the bass drum. Uh, the snare's really dry. The toms that you get are also really dry, but they're really good at projecting a tone, so they're really clean, really crisp toms. Excellent for an articulation based drum solo like what I was just playing. The drums did far better than I did. The bass drum itself, also really articulate, but you get a little bit of extra boom that's not the EQ or anything on the board that we're doing here. It's just the way the bass drum sounds here. Really ringy, a lot of boom. And that's even with uh, the Evans EQ pad pillow inside of it. Uh, just has a lot of low end on it and a lot of high end attack on the bass, not a lot of middle. And the toms themselves uh, just really pick the tone that you've tuned them to, sing with it. And they're very short sustains. So they really lend themselves to just playing and articulating fast little notes all over the place. Really fun. The snare drum is extremely snappy and dry. Uh, not easy to press roll on, uh, but it's extremely easy to get a consistent, strong rock and roll thunder crack. Uh, these are, you know, being walnut maple drums, not what I'd look at for a jazz kit. Uh, you could have a lot of fun in a funk, fusion, or reggae environment, but these really lend themselves, I think, to uh, a scenario where you're doing something perhaps fusion avant-garde, for, uh, for instance, playing rock where you're adding those elements into it. Uh, playing a straight metal gig this would be an amazing kit for that. Uh, but again, not the most lively drums. So where those of you who are used to Ludwig Legacy or Gretsch USA to look to for your live singy jazz drum set or something that you want to rock out on live with no mics, this kit's just going to be a whole lot snappier and tighter. Really ideal for a recording scenario. So um, if this sounds anything like the first run of recording we did on it about 20 minutes ago, I'm really happy with the way these drums record. Very crisp, very clean. Without further ado, I'll let you be the judge of how they sound. We're going to cut to the two overhead mics only here. Turn off everything else. Uh, we're going to a flat EQ as well. So uh, you're literally just going to hear two mics running straight into the camera. Uh, as far as the rest of the video here goes, uh, check out this uh, drum set. See if you like it. And call Greenbrier Music at 540-372-DRUM if you want to snag this demo model. Mm -hmm. 